do you know what just before I let um, Lejean come in and we'll carry on we've got another hour we'll carry on after we come back from the news but I've watched some old footage of Carnival mm -hmm. and in the Caribbean and here the people have clothes on. <laughs> the people actually have clothes on. They've got, I mean, it was a they've family got event. Elab they have elaborate <laughs> it was a costumes, family event, yeah. but nobody's out there in a phone. No. Nobody's out there like rubbing on anybody's private parts. It's extermination. Just, yeah. And I think if we're not intelligent enough to be able to like stop ourselves from the downward spiral, then we're going back to those original European roots of carnival. Because mm -hmm. carnival, that that carnival, mm -hmm. that that is a European thing. That's mm -hmm. a European etymological root mm -hmm. that's based around their bacchanal and their um, saturnalia and, and their pagan festivals. And we're going back to that debauchery and calling it our culture like someone's just sold you and Mickey was, what did Malcolm said you've been bamboozled because this ain't all that you imagine it's going to be but that said five minutes to go Lejean I'd love to hear from you because I haven't actually heard you play for a while yeah. I think it's years now isn't it yeah um, I'm going to play this track called uh, Part View um, it's not as um, maybe as uplifting as I would like but it's it's, it's uh, speaks to our reality yes go ahead take it away <laughs> you standing beautiful the word I use to describe the view dark and clouds are passing but the picture still stays blue and that's the view of you so I cleared the clouds for you Clear the haze for you. I feel in the air for you. For a longer view of us, a view of us, of us from the universe above us. Can't you hear that? Footsteps singing mighty high Pulling faces, calling names Playing all those childish games Can't you hear them running by Followed by gunstrucks, missiles Can't you hear them scream again Mom and Dad, where are they? So I cleared the clouds for you I cleared the haze for you I feel the air for you For a clearer view of us A view of us Of us From the universe above that verse Can't you hear them running by Footsteps singing mighty high Pulling faces calling names Playing all those childish games Can't you hear them running by Followed by gunstrucks missiles Can't you hear them scream again Mom and Dad, where are they? So I clear the clouds for you I clear the haze for you I fill the air for you For a clearer view oh, of us A view of us Of us from the universe above. Yeah. Excellent, well done. Um, we're going to go to the ad breaks. I think we've got a couple of minutes. Just before we go, Trevon, tell me, what. give me some background. What happened to poor Storms? Uh, I'm going to try and be quick. Right, so basically, uh, we know that in the run-up to Carnival, 
um, the police had a series of arrests. I think it was 650 preemptive arrests that were made. Uh, they seized 190 knives, 18 firearms. Um, and then what they did, you know, in this modern world, world now, they tweeted to say that they found you know, in the run up to Carnival um, that they found basically a kilo of cocaine or, some, or something like that. I think it was cocaine um, in Croydon. Obviously, Croydon's very far from Notting Hill, so people right so Stor a lot of people are upset about it, but Stormzy tweeted and when he said he asked was how many he, he tweeted and said how many drugs did you lot seize in the run up to Glastonbury or are we only doing tweets like this for black events see and the thing is and Glastonbury that, historically yeah is a drug filled culture Causes, yeah. and but when you do it even yeah. cocaine yeah that's that, that's do originally you know that's their type of drug for their those drug. types of yeah, spaces I just wanted to say this actually because it was really mm. important because when um when I looked at the stats on it, um, Glastonbury, 100, there's 135,000 people at Glastonbury last year, right? Yeah. And there were 75 arrests. So that means for every 1,800 people, one person was arrested. Mm. Carnival, last year, they estimate there was 2 million people there and there was 454 arrests. So that means that there was one person arrested for one, for each 4,405 people. So it actually means that there was actually more arrests. Almost twice as, more more than than twice, twice as many. More than twice as many. many. In Glastonbury, but then Carnival has that reputation. See, and you're going to tweet and say is, in the run-up. This is the point that Lejean was making before, mm. and we will definitely come back after the ad-breaking finger, but this is the point Lejean was making, because something seems to be afoot here, no? Well, he just got stung now as well. So I was just in the Carnival, and my friend's setting up, I know you. Um, setting up and uh, he was told there's a certain track by Stormzy he's not allowed to play uh, because it's regarding the police wow. so already just by making that move he's mm. upset the police he's upset and you get there's spanked. a lockdown there's a lockdown coming I'm, I don't I don't know what it is I think a friend of mine Dalian um, actually put something on Facebook today Dalian Adolfo um, and he actually put something to say like there's a storm coming so mm. you know but mm. buckle up because you can see the winds of all this stuff yeah. They, they don't do stuff like that and criminalise yeah. a whole group of people yeah. and something is not coming back mm. on us. All right, we're going to take a break. We will be back for the, after the all-important pause for the course. Stay with us for a little bit before you have to run off and, and um, do what you've got to do for the day. But that's why it's so important we talk Black Sea after the break. Amiga Radio, 104.1 FM. News and views around your community.